organization. And it's, uh, once again, I, I can't reiterate enough, uh, domestic violence is not something that will be tolerated within the 49er organization, period. The 49ers finally breaking their silence on the incident at this South Bay home early Sunday morning involving 49er defensive end Ray McDonald. Good evening, everybody. I'm Pam Moore. Today, Ray McDonald took the field for the first time since the domestic violence incident involving him and his fiance. It is still unclear if he will play in Sunday's season opener in Dallas. He's slated to be in court on September the 15th. Crown Force Rob Flatterbo was in the 49er locker room and has reaction from the play. While the 49ers management is calling on the public, on the media, and on fans to reserve judgment against Ray McDonald, who was arrested over the weekend on domestic violence charges against his wife by San Jose police, McDonald's teammates appear to have his back, at least for now, during a locker room availability on Tuesday after practice. Several players say they will continue to support Ray McDonald until all the facts in the case are in. You know, everybody supports Ray here. Like you said, his side will come out. And when it does, you know, I know Ray is a great guy. Everybody in this locker room knows Ray is a great guy. And, and uh, you know, I think everybody's fine right now. All I do know is that Ray is a great guy. He's awesome. You, you can speak for his character. Oh, he's a great character. I mean, everyone on the team knows that. You know, he's a guy of uh, a good integrity, great character. Oh, yeah, everybody supports him. Yeah, everybody supports him and, you know, hope for the better. So that's that's really it. That's all I got. That's our brother. That's our teammate. And uh, we're going to support him. And that's pretty much all I'm going to say about that. Meantime, Ray McDonald, we're told, will continue to practice as per normal. But it's not clear as yet whether he will be able to play in Sunday's opening game. At Levi Stadium in Santa Clara, Rob Flatabo, Cron 4 News.